Hey guys, John here. Welcome back to the series, How to Use Pigments. This is video 16, and today we're going to be talking about more filters, namely the SEM Matrix 12 Mini and the Jupiter 8. And as we already kind of looked at the last video, how the functionality of the filters works, this video is going to be more so a demonstration to see how the filters sound because they sound very, very good. So for this patch, I have kind of a long attack, a slow, a long release, some reverb over here getting sent to the reverb, and some unison voices with two oscillators here, one down, one octave. So it kind of gives us a nice little pad here to work with that we can listen to right here. So we're going to be listening to this and filtering this first one, the SEM right here. So this is going to be the first mode here. So it's completely low pass right here. And now we're going to be going to the band pass. Next up, we're going to be going to a little bit of a low pass to a kind of a, see if you look here, as we turn this right here, we can kind of see this little, this little notch filter kind of happening in here. As we move this along, we kind of hear this, well, you'll listen. Very cool sound here. And you can mess around with all this different modes here because it has a lot of fun stuff to play around with. Moving on, one of my favorites is gonna be the Matrix 12. So let's take a listen to this at the 24 dB per octave low pass. And this also has quite a lot of modes here. We have low pass 12, low pass 24, high pass 12, band pass 12, band pass 24, notch plus low pass six, phase plus low pass six. So let's take a listen at these ones here because they're a little bit more specialty. Moving on to the phase low pass six. Next up we have the mini, which is my personal favorite of this entire synth. So take a listen to this, how the filter sounds.
Now we also have the dry feature here, so take a listen to this here. These filters just sound amazing. So this is one of my favorite things about the synth is the filters are out of this world. Next up, we have the Jupiter 8, the classic, not my personal favorite, but it does sound good. Now for this one, we have the cutoff and the resonance and just a different filter here, the low pass 12 and the 24. So here is the 12. That was the Jupiter 8. So a lot of these filters do sound very good. My favorite being the Matrix 12 and the Mini. I think the Mini is by far my favorite one of this entire synth. So thank you for watching. The next one, we are going to be talking about the last three here, which is the Comb, Phaser, and Formant, as those are more specialty types of filters. And I feel that those should have a separate video for those. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.